The municipality of Granada is the capital of the province of Granada and the town is steeped in legend and history. Supposedly founded by Grana, one of Noah's daughters, or more likely of these two stories by Granata, one of Hercules' daughters, as Hercules appears in the flags of Andalusia. But I have another episode about that over here if you want to find out more about that one. There's also reports that the town was established by the first Jewish dysphoria. However, the earliest settlements are linked to Trudulia, the most significant Iberian tribe in Andalusia around the 5th BC. So, a little while ago. Either way, the town has its own flag, like many in Spain, and the current one was adopted on the 23rd of February 2009. The flag has a sharp crimson and green made of two equal vertical stripes, with the town's coat of arms placed at its centre. The busy coat of arms was granted by the Catholic monarchs, King Ferdinand V, with a sword and Queen Elizabeth I, I guess, sitting opposite him. Both of them are on their thrones, above what's supposed to be a pomegranate. To be fair, reminds me of a vervoid from a science fiction series called Doctor Who, which apparently reminds a lot of people of what? What? No? Okay, I've been told to move on. The castle is, in fact, the watchtower with a flag of Spain. This is surrounded by 12 pieces in turn, a lion and a castle with the base of the castle carrying two flags of Spain this time. Around this is a tassel with the motto, very noble, very loyal, named, great, famous and heroic city of Granada. In Latin, of course. And perched at the top is a royal crown. An original version of the flag was approved on the 6th of September 1983, where the red symbolised the Nazareth dynasty and the green for the colour of Islam. To discover more flags around Spain, including the aforementioned Andalusia, then you need to click on this video here to find out how a purple, a seldom used colour in flags, appeared on Malaga's flag.